What's going on guys, Ivan here and in this video I want to show you how many kilowatt hours this 2015 BMW i3 with a range extender will receive from 8% to 100%. In addition to that, I also want to show you what kind of charging speeds we're going to get through the whole process from the beginning to the end. All right, we got, let's see. 43,641 miles. We got 41 miles left to empty for the range extender. I've been running that for the last 30 to 40 minutes uh, since I just came from West Virginia. There was nothing available there to charge, uh, but luckily this also managed to save me from running out of juice. Um, we're at seven and a half percent. This was jumping up between seven and a half and eight and a half. So I guess we're starting here at seven and a half. And uh, yeah, that's it. Let's go ahead and plug this car up. All right, 46 kilowatts at around 11%. All right, currently we're charging at 47 kilowatts with 15% charge so far. Now we're at 24% at 45 kilowatts. 33% with 44 kilowatts of power. Still holding strong, 44 kilowatts of charging speed at 42%. So just across the 50% state of charge mark. And let's see what kind of charging speed we're getting now. And this still set at 50%, it was at 42 kilowatts. All right, we tapered down to 37 kilowatts of charging speed at 58%. 65%. And 31 kilowatts of charging speed. All right, 75 percent and 20 kilowatts. At 84 percent, we have 11 kilowatts. 94 percent, three kilowatts of charging speed, and look at that, 14.74 kilowatt hours delivered. All right, we're fully charged, 99.5%, 67 miles to empty. So, over the course of this charging session, the charger delivered 15.6 kilowatt hours of energy from around 7.5% to 99.5%. From the factory, this 2015 model does have a 22 kilowatt pack. Uh, looks like out of that, about 18.88 is usable. And with the 15.61 uh, kilowatt hours delivered from the charger earlier, plus the 7.5% that was still on the battery, I think we're right at around 17 kilowatt, uh, kilowatt hours of usable energy, which if you divide that by the 18.88 uh, that's usable, I think you can get roughly about a 10% range loss over the course of its 43,000 mile lifespan. Now I take this information with a grain of salt. I came to this conclusion based on what the car showed me, uh, what the Electrify America charging station showed me, and what I read online. Click that thumbs up button if you like this video. If you have any kind of questions, leave it below. And of course, subscribe. You'll be notified whenever I put out new content. See you in the next one.